Yeah, okay, okay. Where is the plot? What cemetery? Okay. Yes, yes, and the vaults, yes, I know the area. Yep. My name is Lou John Frito. I'm a funeral director with Tobin Brothers Funerals. I meet with families when the death occurs, arranging and planning the funeral uh, with the family and then document their wishes. Sam, they need to remove the top, the, the granite top, the slab that's sitting on the monument at the moment needs to be removed. Once that's done, we can then start our measuring processes and, and checking the grave to make sure that the casket that we're going to use for your mum's funeral will fit without too many problems. This is the day sheet of today. There's 27 funerals on this day sheet, and that is the number of funerals that our company's conducting today. It does contain enormous amount of information, and if it's not absorbed and, and, and understood clearly, we, we can get into an area where we have service delivery failures. We're dealing with families that have given us very specific instructions, and the emotion behind each one of those instructions is so critical and so important. Hey, Robert. Good to go. How are you, mate? Yeah, good, thanks, mate. Good to see you. These are actually my funeral documents that um, I'll be using to conduct the funeral this afternoon. So what I need to do now is uh, ensure that the documents are all complete, that all the necessary forms are here. I often have people say to me, well, I suppose you get used to doing what you do. And my response to that is I never really do get used to doing what I do, because I think if I did get to that stage, I'm blasé about it, oh yes, I'm used to it, then it's the time that I give it away. There's a good start, I can't find the coffin. <laughs> oh dear, there we are, there we are. I need to identify the correct deceased person in the coffin, even though the name plate on the coffin tells me that the person that I'm doing the funeral for is the one that I should, be, should have, but I do need to actually open the coffin now, check the name tag, and make sure that it corresponds with the name on the name plate. It's certainly an interesting industry to be in because you're dealing with people with different ideas, different thoughts, uh, different needs. So you need to be adaptable or interchangeable to, to, to suit all those, those factors, I guess. Never a dull moment, is there, boys? Never a dull moment. It's really good fun, isn't it? Both Robert and Kingsley are our, uh, two of our embalmers here at North Melbourne. Yep, I've signed her out, so we're right to go. that person's life that's died, you take it on board and you, it becomes part of your own life to a certain extent. I'm quite passionate about what I do. It's very sad and difficult at times to not bring some of that stuff with you back at home and in your own private life, but it is a special job. <laughs> 